According to the Centers for Disease Control, more than 67% of Americans now categorized as overweight or obese. Yep, many people are searching for ways to lighten up and become healthier, especially at this time of the year. And one thing to consider is trying a vegetarian diet. Dr. Zorba Pastor joins us from his clinic in Oregon. Hi, Zorba. Hi, Zorba. Hi, it's good to be here. Now, why is this something people should think about or maybe try? Well, this particular study out of the University of South Carolina looked at vegetarian diets that were vegan diets. Now, a vegan diet are only vegetable products, whereas vegetarian diets often include some animal products such as butter, eggs, yogurt, and so on. You're not actually eating meat, meat itself, but you're eating meat products. And they compared people who only ate vegetables to people who are vegetarians eating, as I said, dairy products, for example, for people who are eating some fish and people who are eating red meat. And it turned out that the vegans, which were the most restrictive diets, lost the most weight. They lost up to 16 pounds over a six-month period, which was quite a lot and it means that that may be a diet that people want to try especially before the holiday season begins why do they lose so much weight other than i couldn't eat all those vegetables i would just start losing weight because you get full <laughs> before you call it lettuce you know, uh, there, there are a number of issues here. First of all, the interesting thing about the vegan diet is that there are more carbohydrates in the vegan diet than we're used to eating because we know that low-fat diets sometimes will make you gain more weight, and the vegan diet is basically often a low-fat, high-carb diet. I think part of it is that in the study, the people who are vegans were more committed, if you look at what they were doing, than the people who are vegetarians and then the people who are just sort of eating everything. So I think part of it, when I looked at the research was commitment. But the other part of it is find a diet that works for you. For instance, I could never be on a vegan diet because I like to eat all sorts of things. But if I'm on a regular food diet, it's simply eating fewer calories. But for people who are searching, try vegetarianism, try veganism, see if it works for you and see if it helps you lose weight. The same old thing doesn't work for a lot of people who want to lose weight. It seems like the age old adage, everything in moderation is probably the Everything way is, to go. Absolutely, and I think that's really what this study shows again. Now, moderation is hard to do around Thanksgiving and Christmas, <laughs> but before that time, or in between the high time of those holiday suppers, moderation may be the key, certainly to not gaining weight during the next six weeks. All right, good advice as usual. Thank you, Dr. Zorba Pastor from his clinic in Oregon. Good to we'll see you, Zorba.